Hello student, welcome back to our JE Prep channel. Hope all of you are doing well. Today we will solve very interesting sum on variation of gene with latitude. Let's read the problem. Find the angular speed with which the earth would have to rotate on its axis so that the person on the equator would weigh 3 by 5 times as much as present. Take radius of the earth as r. So in this problem, what we want to find out, we want to find out the angular speed with which the earth would have to rotate on its axis so that the person on the equator would weigh 3 by 5 times as much as the present. Let the person is standing on the equator, the person is standing here. So its weight w is directed in this direction while the centrifugal force will be in this direction. So therefore, net weight will be W dash is equal to W minus M omega square R. But actually, they have mentioned that W dash is 3 by 5 times present weight of the person. And we know that W is equal to Mg. So let's work out this. So this is 3 by 5 mg is equal to mg minus f omega square r. Now what will happen? This m will cancel and then we'll get very simple equation 3 by 5g is equal to g minus omega square r. So omega square r is equal to g minus 3 upon 5 into g. So this comes out to be 2 by 5g. Now we want to find out the angular speed and omega is the angular speed. So therefore omega square is equal to 2 upon 5 g upon r. Hence omega is equal to under root 2 by 5 g upon r. So the angular speed of the person who is standing on the equator where his weight becomes 3 by 5 times the present weight is under root 2 by 5 g upon r. So let's see which is the correct option. So c is the correct option. I hope all of you understood this problem and student if you really want to perform very well in the JE examination or in the MACT examination, I strongly recommend all of you to subscribe our channel. Thank you.